to tear King's Heath and its diversity apart. And and, we're turning the music yeah, we'll turn it off. And, um, and they tried to divide us and it actually made us stronger and this event is proving that it makes us stronger. <laughs> and over the past month um, I've been trying to liaise with different parts of the community um, and with Mohammed at the mosque, um, King's Heath Mosque. Um, even though I'm not Muslim, I'm not religious, it holds a place in my heart because I've been really welcoming um, towards why place matters and why events like today really matter to this community and this community going forward. Um, because whilst I share in many ways Luke's aspirations, we know that actually the communities in this city and in this area face many challenges at the moment. And whilst our diversity is something we should celebrate and be proud of, yeah, a lot of woods and stuff like that. So, if anyone. A young shining star from King's Head, Luke Holland, organized a community conference at Sillet Restaurant. Special attendance Councillor Lisa Trickett, Councillor Claire Spencer, Fred Ratley. Jessica Foster, Sadat Mia Shamsul, Shofiqul Haq, Hadiba Shah, Muhammad Ali, a famous artist, Bill Lees, Peter, Pet Bailey, and many, many others. Things hit together a community conference. Today, they set up the King's Heat Charter. A charter bringing together different parts of King's Heath. They had delegations from All Saint Church and Central Masjid King's Heath. King's Heath is a great diverse community and together they have a plan to tackle litter, graffiti, and crime. King's Heath is one amazing united community. York Road in King's Heath and we've been here today to start forming the basis of the King's Heath Charter and this is just a set of principles by which a diverse area like King's Heath can actually guide the way that we all live and treat one another. So we've had a lot of discussion about what people value about the area, they love the diversity, they love the parks, they love the spaces where we can do lots of community events and actually we've been just talking about some really practical ways that we can all make this a much better place for everyone to live in. So I'm really hopeful about the future. We're going to take it out on consultation for the next few months to see if people out there in the community agree that this is the right way to go. We're going to have a word with the council about things we might be able to do in terms of training to help people be a bit more effective with it. But it's been a great day. You know, really pleased that Luke and Jess have pulled this together, and hopefully this will be the beginning of a brand new chapter for King's Heath. Very grateful to Luke and to Thrive for getting us together here today. Because in a hospitable space, uh, we've met people we might not have met before. And in a political climate, uh, I would describe as, as poisoned by jealousy. And I feel really glad to have been part of a conversation that was positive, energetic, creative, and uh, genuinely celebrating the way our difference is an enrichment, not a problem. And I uh, feel very proud of him as he uh, already did, but now feel um, even prouder that it's not sitting on its laurels as an interesting neighbourhood, but really is uh, expecting growth and nurture and greater safety and greater mutual respect and understanding. It's not about diminishing our differences, nor even uh, tolerating them. It's about feeling that they are a blessing. And uh, so it's been a really good afternoon. And it feels very much like a beginning. So thank you for the opportunity. Um, the event this afternoon has been absolutely fantastic. We have seen a range of faiths, 
all ages come together to truly discuss what they like about King's Heath and how we can become a much more cohesive community where actually people do feel that they are actively supported in King's Heath, where they feel safe, where they feel secure. What I really like about today was the practical offers of help that people are bringing forward and we talk a lot about movements for change and it really feels like this afternoon was very much part of a movement and it was great that we were able to actually be uh, taking part in the event with one of our independent businesses and it was great food, great atmosphere and thanks to everyone who organised it. Today here in King's Heath we're setting up the King's Heath Charter. The King's Heath Charter is bringing together residents, businesses, local faith institutions and we're going to set at the Charter. The Charter is aimed at bringing King's Heath together as one community because we thrive on diversity. We're tackling issues such as litter, street cleansing, getting young people actively involved in their community. Hello, I'm Jessica. I've lived in King's Heath since I was 18, which is a long time now. Um, I'm really excited about today. It's fantastic to see people coming together to talk about the area, to celebrate all that is good in it and to think about ways that we can work together to make it even better. There's a fantastic mixture of people here because there are a fantastic mixture of people in King's Heath. King's Heath is proud of its diversity, we're known for it and it's one of the reasons I love living here and why I've brought my children up here. Today at King's Heath Community Conference and uh, different uh, community members and groups have uh, come together here at this special event to talk about community cohesive issues and how we can resolve and reconcile many issues within the area and this is leading towards building um, a, the King's Heath Community Charter built on various themes across the area so different faiths and different people from walks of life, different walks of life have united here today on a common ground to discuss issues that they are passionate about and that they would like improvement.